Hello, everybody, and welcome to another edition of Today in History. Happy April. It's April 3rd, 2023. Hope everybody is having a great spring so far. Uh, some interesting events that happened in the world on April 3rd. First off, today in 1882, Jesse James bites the dust. The notorious outlaw Jesse James head of the James Gang and mastermind of countless bank and train robbers, was gunned down today at his home in St. Joseph, Missouri. Neighbors were shocked to learn that the man they knew as Thomas Howard had a $10,000 price tag on his head. James met his end at the hands of a new recruit to the gang, Bob Ford, who was staying with James, his wife, and two children. James's 20-year life of crime began at the end of the Civil War, after an apprenticeship with the pro-Confederate band of guerrilla fighters, led by William Quantrill. After the war, James and his brother Frank founded their own gang, but in 1876, an attempted bank raid in Northfield, Minnesota, went wrong and the gang was decimated. Also today, in 1991, was the death of author Graham Greene, in, who died at the age of 86. That same day was the death of Martha Graham, dancer, choreographer, and pioneer of the Confeder contemporary dance of the United States. And now for some birthdays today. The first birthday we have today is Doris Day, who was born on this day in 1922. She was, an, she was an American Hollywood actress and singer who delighted audiences with musicals such as The Pajama Game and Calamity Jane. She lived a very long life and died in May of 2019 at the old age of 97. The other birth, uh, another birthday we have today is Marlon Brando, who was born on this day in 1924. He was a Hollywood actor. He was known as a method actor. And he won Oscars uh, for On the Waterfront and The Godfather. And the last birthday we have today is Amanda Bynes, who is 37 today. Amanda Bynes began her career when she was about 10 when she was about 10 years old. She was a recurring guest star on the popular live action Nickelodeon sitcom All That. She also starred on her own sitcom, The Amanda Show, and was a guest star. Uh, for a few episodes of the ninth and final season of the popular long-running Nickelodeon cartoon, Rugrats. That is all for Today in History. Again, hope everybody is having a great spring so far. Hope everybody's looking forward to Easter. And I'll see you next time.